Regenesis, the world leader in in situ soil and groundwater remediation and vapor barrier systems, has developed a reputation for delivering cutting edge technologies that are proven in the lab and demonstrated in the field. First, you have to identify your need. What are the real world challenges going to be with the product? And then what we do is we look for ways to address that problem in the lab, trying to get the chemistry right, and then hopefully the final step is release of a product that we know is going to work. Building on a legacy of innovation, starting with the first ever in situ application of oxygen release compound, Regenesis has consistently led the industry with groundbreaking in situ technologies based on cutting edge science to clean up its sites globally. I became convinced that Regenesis doesn't come to the market with a product until it works and that it will work pretty much every time if you do your homework right up front. The Regenesis R&D development process includes first establishing a need in the market. Next, extensive development and testing is performed in the lab that may include tank and column studies, microbial data and more. The team then identifies a variety of test sites where beta testing can be performed in the field. Following beta testing, the team further refines the product in the lab. Once proven effective, the product is commercialized and released for wider use. From familiar contaminants like petroleum hydrocarbons and chlorinated solvents to emerging compounds like polyfluorinated alkyl or PFAS compounds, Regenesis leads the way with demonstrated results. The R&D team at Regenesis has recently been conducting various experiments to look at the sorptive capacity for containing PFAS contamination and also how we can use that to predict how long we're going to contain these plumes through some modeling studies. The research and development team is really excited and motivated by all the development coming out of Regenesis. Before Regenesis introduces a new product, the team of R&D scientists spends countless hours ensuring it will perform effectively, with no surprises in the field delivering on the promise of complete remediation. Part of that process includes a beta test phase where scientists work on site, evaluating and monitoring performance to better understand how the new technologies will perform on a variety of site types. Working with clients and the Regenesis Remediation Services team, the R&D team can then identify any issues before commercialization and modify product formulations based on their observation of performance in the field. Beta testing our products gives us the opportunity to see what the issues are to the people that are actually applying the product. We want it to be something that's uh, convenient to order, convenient to use, and most importantly, gets you the results that you want on your site. The technical service that Regenesis provides is second to none. They have excellent people that do a very good job of assisting you with interpreting your data, providing suggestions for looking at other options, and basically being your partner rather than just a vendor selling chemicals. Working at Regenesis has been nice because you really get the opportunity to go to the lab, develop a product, and then bring it on site and actually put it in the ground. And at the same time, you're working with clients, you're talking with clients about what their needs are, and you get to see the results. It's a good feeling to be able to be a part of that from start to finish.